Hello everybody, it is Alexander here, and this is the next Friso tutorial. I know the other Friso tutorial was supposed to be how to run a store, but that will be delayed because it seems there are people out there having installation trouble still. So this video series will, or well, this video in particular will be about how to install the game. Well, I hope you enjoy it, and if you like it, rate thumbs up. So first, you're going to need to go to the website, friso.net. Once you are there, you're going to see this website. Take note of this here. Freeso must be run as an administrator to function properly, no matter where you install it. So first, you click the Download Freeso button. Keep in mind it's just for Windows. Click the Download Freeso button. But first, we're going to create a folder on the desktop called Folder. And I'm going to name it Freeso Global Folder. You can name it whatever you'd like, really. But Download Freeso and give this a minute and extract this to your desktop. In another folder, I'm going to call it extract folder. You can extract it in the other folder if you want, but I'm going to extract it here because it'll make the folders less messy. Okay, so we're going to bring this over here. So the one you want is freeso installer.exe. So right click, run it as an administrator. Press yes. So here is the directory folder. And what you're going to want to do, <coughs> sorry, is change this directory here. Go to the uh, desktop, click on where you want it to go. Here I want it to go to the Freeso global folder. Install. Now, this is where some people will get stuck. Now, if you would like to play the legacy version, which was the alpha version of the game where you simply created a sim and then you jumped into the game and entered a server name, then you want legacy. But if you want the one where everyone else is and you want to create your own sim, make an account, and keep all your progress, then you want the global version. And that's where everyone's being. So let's click Global Server Edition. So this is going into this folder right here. So you are going, because I'm install, because everything because not everything's in that folder, I'm going to click install everything. Yes, go ahead. Now I'm going to go ahead and stop it here until it's actually ready. When it is, I will release it again. Okay, see you guys soon. Once the Sims Online is finished installing, it will automatically download the Friso files. Just give it a second and it will work. Well, again, it'll take a little bit. My internet here at the dorm is slow, but give it a minute or two and it will finish. Also, if it crashes, try running it as an administrator again or reinstalling it because sometimes it might crash. But this, is temp this isn't permanent, but we will see. If you have not installed OpenL on your computer, then click yes. I, however, do, so I'm gonna click no. So here's the button where you need to go to create a free sale account. Click the button. Here it is. The website will be in the description. To play free so, you click here. Just give it a second. Yep. It worked. All right, everybody. Hopefully this was helpful. I would like to thank JD for actually making this very helpful installer. He is the mastermind behind it. He, If you have any questions about the installer, then please go to JD. But this should hopefully answer every question that you have. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I will see you all next time. Happy simming.